what's up fam how are you doing welcome to my youtube channel if it's your first time here thank you so much for coming and if you recently joined my channel just know that i really really do appreciate you thank you for subscribing thank you for sharing like my channel with other people for those who've been sharing my channel with other people thank you so much and my returning subscribers i don't even know what i'll do without you because this channel exists because of you you're the reason why i'm creating all this content thank you so much thank you thank you thank you so much on today's video good people i'm going to talk about the do's for a strong personality so last week i spoke about uh signs that will help you know if you have a strong personality or not and if you didn't watch that video please click on that link popping maybe you can go watch it now or maybe you can watch it as soon as we are done with this video so that you know whether you're a, you have a strong personality or not in the beginning of this video i started with a quote by jimmy evans which was saying that if god gave you a strong personality it's for serving others and not controlling them and you'll find that people with strong personality sometimes tend to maybe hurt other people without knowing or maybe just because you have a strong personality you know the things that you might say that might hurt someone else but you according to your personality you think it's okay so this video is something that i was supposed to shoot i think maybe in 2019 or even 2018 and the reason why i wanted to do it it was actually on my list on my to shoot list i usually list them down like the topics that i want to discuss so it was there so it's been there for a very long time and the reason why i wanted to shoot it or rather to share with you is because in my last employment um, uh, there, are kind of, there are different people that I met, of course, of different personalities, and they were able to just make me realize that sometimes when you have a strong personality, that things that, that there's a way that you need to treat other people. And I'm just going to go straight into this. I only have five points today, not so many, by the way, five points. I'm going to explain, of course, all of them to you guys. So let's just get into this video right now. Yes. The first thing that you need to do when you have a strong personality out there is learn how to deal with other personalities. Learn how to tackle people with different personalities other than yours. You get like not everyone is going to have the same personality as you. Some people are going to take time before they answer to questions. Some people are going to take time before they do things. This is something that you need to learn if you have a strong personality, especially if you're a leader out there and you're dealing with other people, you know. So there are people that are okay with being corrected like there and then when they've done a mistake. There are those people who are you have to maybe bring them aside and talk to them and tell them you know you did this and that blah 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 in a very like they're just different way on how to handle these people if you treat them the same way that you want someone to treat you sometimes it might end up hurting them because they don't have that strong personality and some people may feel like maybe you're belittling them or something like that you know yeah so the second do's for a strong personality is choose your battles wisely. Like always know that anytime you get into a conflict, it's going, it's going to cost you something. Anytime you're dealing with someone who's not from the same personality as you, handle them with care. And most of the time, try and understand where they're coming from. And I'll give an example. In my last employment at the time, we used to have barbecue events like barbecue parties every Friday. Not every Friday, but once in a while, like maybe once in three months on Fridays. And we we're the ones who used to organize everything. Like we'll, the meat would come, the goat meat would be brought in the office. And then uh, we'll have someone maybe doing the salad, someone doing something, someone just marinating the whatever. So that day I was the one who was marinating the meat. And then we had assigned someone else to do the, uh, what do you call it, the salad. So when I finished marinating the meat, the person who was doing the salad, I felt like they were too slow on doing it. And just me saying that they were too slow, I mean, it really affected them. To me, I felt that that, that is what was happening. They were slow, according to me. But the way the person took it, it was so wrong. Like, it's like maybe I was trying to make them feel like um, they're just, I don't know, you get. Like, because for me, if I was the one doing it and someone comes and tells me that, hey, Christine, you're slow. Do you know, I want... I'll be like, yeah, for sure, I think I need to. I need to maybe hurry up, you get. So I won't take it personal. The way they took it, it's not the way I expected all that conversation to go. And I just got back to my seat and I was like, ask myself questions like, did I like, do I make people feel like that? Or why would someone take it that way, you know? And the fact is, the way the two of us were raised, it's totally different. Where I came from, if something is done wrong, you're told there. If you've, if you've done something wrong, you are told there and then, and then you're correcting it, and then they will tell you how to do it faster, and then you move to the next. But these people, maybe where they're coming from, I mean, this person, where, where, where they were coming from, they were not being treated like that, like things were handled differently. So it just, I took time to just get to learn myself. When I was starting my own company, I was just trying to learn myself and even treat people differently, not just the way, you know, not the way Christian would want to be treated, like in terms of, uh, 
ukiniambia tu ati by the way unakosa by the way leo umebeat i mean like to me i won't take it personal like i will it will be okay but there are people out there my good friends if you have a strong personality just learn how to deal with other people and choose your battles wisely yes i think i've done enough talking about that point yeah i hope you got what i'm trying to say yes and not just mumbling mumbling over here so anyway my third point is my third point is take time before you speak like think fast not just speak because you know words once they come out they never they can never go back they say that maji akisha mwangika haya azoleki that's the word yes once you once those words come out they will never go back in so just take time i know people with strong personality out there we tend to think faster like you tend to answer things like whenever you ask something you'll always give an answer and that was me when i was back in college like anytime a teacher would ask a question imagine my hand was always up there like i would put my hand up sometimes i always have like an answer even if it's a wrong answer or the right answer but what i feel like it's, it's the answer that i should give to the question that was asked is what i will raise my hand and say so if i'm wrong the teacher will tell me i'm wrong and i'll be good to go if i'm correct it's okay like i don't like i won't take a lot of time before i answer something like it's like sometimes it's like you think faster like you always <laughs> the remember there's a friend of mine called beryl and beryl was like sometimes christine i wonder how many tabs are open in your mind you know like i wonder how many tabs are open in that mind of yours because i always have like i don't know maybe someone out there can relate to what i'm saying like you think faster and sometimes you say something thinking that it's okay and the way you're going to say it might affect someone else so just take time before you speak and think fast think my friend think like it's something we need to do when you have a strong personality out there is something you need to keep practicing because not everyone is like you my fourth point is treat people with respect like treat other people with respect if you have a strong personality out there i know that maybe you you're very quick to doing stuff maybe when you're given a task you'll be able to finish it faster maybe you're able to you know think faster do things like chop chop you know so whenever you have someone else who takes their time to do stuff please just respect them just because they have different personality does not mean that now you have to disrespect them that's why in the first point i said you need to learn how to deal with other personalities because i believe that once you learn how to deal with other personalities then definitely you'll have to respect their personality it is yes the fifth point is give other people an opportunity too especially if you have a strong personality and you're a leader out there and then you happen to have employees who there's one who have a strong personality and they're always expressing themselves they are always you know they're always ready to answer questions in during your meetings give those ones who are also maybe not outspoken to also speak up because they always have something by the way and this also applies to when you're doing projects you find that maybe those who have strong personality are very good when it comes to doing projects faster they are very very you know they are more i think maybe they are born leaders let me say that <laughs> and they are always able to tackle things faster so of course there are those projects that take longer you can assign them to those other people that you know once you know your employees and once you learn them well you'll be able to just give everyone opportunity to express themselves and do something you get yes so we've gotten to the end of this video those are the points that i have for today again again good people if you're watching this and you like it please just thumbs up i don't know why i usually get a lot of views but when it comes to thumbs up there's nothing like if you like it thumbs up if you don't like it thumbs down it's okay i'm learning so i at least i get to know what's going on what am i doing right what am i doing you know uh, wrong like i need to learn so please guys just comment and let me know what you think of this video let me know what you'd like to watch if you've gotten here and you haven't subscribed to my channel please press on that lady popping right there and until next time good people kisses to you i'm sending love